Ladies and gentlemen, Dave McFall here, and today I'm going to be reviewing another one of my um, cardboard Star Wars models. So this one is a Rebel Blockade Runner. As you can see, um, the middle section is very rectangular, which is not anything like a Blockade Runner, and it's really not the best depiction, but the interior is rather nice. So I thought I would let you have a look at it. So I'm going to start off with the front, uh, it's very round, cylindrical, the viewport is very low, but it works out okay. And then in the back there are 11 thrusters, as you can see, and then two small laser cannons, one on each side. And then there are two dual laser emplacements on the top, and there are three rebellion symbols um, on the top of the ship. And then there are two tabs. I will open this up to show you the main compartment, and there is a hallway that is rather reminiscent of Princess Leia's Blockade Runner because the interior is white, so that worked out well, even though there's a little printing. Uh, but that doesn't lead anywhere, it's just there for show. And then there's the commander's desk and two seats for, um, well, there's for personnel or soldiers or really whatever you need. And then there's also another hallway there that doesn't lead anywhere and it is also for show. And then there are two seats here with control screens, one for gunner and one for communications. Now we'll go on to the cockpit. Oh, and as you can see, the tabs actually fit into the design, which is rather cool. And then this opens up and there are three seats and a large control panel and the middle seat is the commander's seat. Close that back up. And that is pretty much it for the blockade runner. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please like it, comment, and subscribe if you haven't already, and I will see you next time.